हेलो स्टूडेंट्स गुड टाइम टू ऑल एंड चंदन कुमार प्रधान वेलकम टू यूट्यूब चैनल चंदन फिजिक्स इन दिस वीडियो वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस डिवीजन ऑफ एम्पलीट्यूड एंड वेब फ्रंट लेट्स व्हाट इज इंटरफेरेंस इंटरफेरेंस इज द फिनोमेन ऑफ रीडिस्ट्रीब्यूशन ऑफ एनर्जी इन द मीडियम ड्यू टू सुपरपोजिशन ऑफ द वेब्स हैविंग सेम फ्रीक्वेंसी सेम एम्पलीट्यूड्स एंड दिज वेब्स आर ट्रावलिंग इन द मीडियम इन द सेम डिरेक्शन एंड हैविंग कंस्टेंट फेज डिफरेंस बिटवीन देम इज नोन एज एंटरफेरेंस due to that of interference if that be the screen due to the superposition of two waves and these waves having same amplitudes same frequency and traveling in the same direction having constant phase difference then in that of screen we observe a pattern the pattern are looking like this there are alternate dark and bright these portions are bright these dotted portions are dark these are known as the fringe these are dark fringes that are bright fringes and this pattern is known as interference pattern this pattern interference pattern means alternate dark and bright fringes are obtained on that of screen due to the superposition of two waves and these waves having same frequency same amplitudes and traveling in the same direction with constant phase difference and that phenomenon is known as interference how exactly the interference pattern we observe here is a wave so that wave that portion is the crest that portion is the true if it has another wave it has crest it has true if the first wave and second wave the crest of first wave and the crest of second wave is superimposed with each other then we obtain a bright fringe here or the intensity of light is maximum and we obtain the bright fringe if the crest of that wave is superimposed with the true of that wave like this then we obtain the dark fringe means minimum intensity of that of light in this way we observe the phenomenon of interference and obtain that interference pattern now there are two methods to obtain interference 
and these methods are known as division of wave front and division of amplitudes methods of 10 a sustained interference pattern sustained interference pattern what is sustained interference pattern sustained interference pattern that is that type of interference pattern means that interference pattern does not change with time means the dark fins or bright fins are not change with respect to time. Sustained interference pattern means the interference pattern does not change with respect to time. In other words, we can say if a point on a screen is having minimum intensity, then the intensity will minimum forever. If it is maximum, also the intensity having maximum forever. There are two methods to obtain sustained interference pattern that is division of wave front and division of amplitudes. By using these two methods, we get the interference pattern that is the sustained interference pattern. So, what is division of wave front? The name indicates the wave front is divided. In Huggins principle, we study about the concept of wave front. So, that concept is used here. Whenever one primary wave front produce two secondary wave fronts on illumination of the two slates by a single source, then the division of wave front is obtained. Division of wave front is obtained when one primary wave front is divided into two secondary wave fronts by using two slits. Here uh, we may use the phenomena like reflection, refraction or diffraction to divide that incident wave front into two identical parts. Again, the division of wave front can also be used by using a source and its virtual image using two virtual images of a single source. Some examples of division of wave front. like 
यंग्स डबल स्लेट एक्सपेरिमेंट फ्रेशनेल्स बै फ्रेशम लेलियर्स सिंगल मिरियर मेथड दीज आर सम एग्जाम्पल्स टू प्रड्यूस द इंटरफ्रेंस पार्टन बाय डिविजन ऑफ वे फ्रंट let just a hints towards young's double slit experiment there will be a sources it's a slit there will be two sources just like s1 and s2 that be the screen that source is a point source so it creates spherical wave fronts by using hagen's principle this is the point light source s1 and s2 again the wave fronts are superimposed with each other in that of screen we obtain alternate dark and bright fringes these are the interference pattern here we get bright fringes in the central right next alternating dark and bright fringes are obtained when we take the constructive interference then we obtain the maxima or bright fringe when that is the destructive interference we obtain the dark fringe minima these are studied in details in upcoming videos so just a hint to our young double slit experiment how the wave front is divided means the division of wave fronts how we created the division of wave fronts and these sources are coherent in all these scenarios the sources must be coherent means the waves in these sources have constant phase difference next division of amplitude if a single beam of light is partially reflected or refracted from two sources they cover different distances before interfering to cause interference pattern here the broader source of light are used to produce interference and the amplitude of incident wave is divided into reflected and refracted waves and is so called division of amplitude some examples of division of amplitudes by the method of division of amplitudes we obtain the interference pattern some examples like interference in thin film thin film newton's ring fabry ferret interferometer
नेक्स्ट माइकलसन्स इंटरफेरोमीटर इन ऑल दिस थिंग्स वी ऑफ्टेन द इंटरफेरेंस पार्ट इन बाय डिविजन ऑफ एम्पलीट्यूड्स here we just a look towards michelson's interferometer how we obtain that interference pattern let here is a source that's a mirror that is silver plate that is the surface having reflection and refraction here we obtain a mirror m1 so the light reflected again at the surface m1 it is reflected back some light is refracted again i use a mirror m2 here so the light further reflected from that of mirror m2 and finally the light passes through that and we obtain the interference pattern on that of screen just like dark and bright fringes are obtained and this interference pattern is observed due to the division of amplitudes all these points here we use the source of light as border and that single beam of light is partially reflected or refracted that of surface and we take the interference pattern this is just an example how division of amplitude is a method to produce an interference pattern these examples are broadly studied throughout that of upcoming videos so in this particular video lecture we understand one of the phenomenon of light that is interference methods to obtain a sustained interference pattern two methods one is division of wavefront another one is division of amplitude all these cases the sources must be coherent here wavefront is divided your amplitude is divided some examples of division of wavefront that is young's double slit experiment fresnel wave regime Lehler's single mirror. Just a look towards Young's double slit experiment. How a friend is divided. Next, in that particular case, division of amplitude. Examples like thin film, Newton's ring, Faber-Fermat interferometer, Michelson interferometer are the examples of division of a friend. Sorry, division of amplitude to obtain an interference pattern. And a an brief idea how division of amplitude occurred. to take interference pattern in case of michelson interferometer so with this useful and informative notes let me wind up this session thank you